Hello, this is Chiron Intuition, and I'm here to do a reading for the collective. It's not going to resonate with everyone, but if it does, take what goes, and please, leave what does not. We have the Page of Swords energy here. Let me get something with this Page of Sword. Now we all know by now that the Page of Sword is the nosy one, or they're the one paying attention, or they're the one trying to get some information. They curious as hell. We know who the Page of Swords is, okay? Let me get something here. They could be watching. Oh, we got the Ten of Cups here, but this is too many. Let me look at it. The Ten of Cups, the Ace of Cups, and the Five of Sword. So there is someone watching your happy... Man, I get so tired of this. Just close your eyes. Go to sleep. Stop watching people's happiness. Just leave them alone. If, the, if, if their happiness don't make you happy, then just leave it alone. Leave it alone. Oh my God. We only got one card out here. I'm already done. We have the Eight of Pentacles here. Okay. Maybe they watching you do your job. Okay. They watching your skill. We have the cherry here. They're definitely watching you move forward. Are they going to watch you move forward? Maybe you got a different job. Maybe you're getting a promotion. Maybe you're just moving for work. It's something here, but they just can't keep their eyes off you. We have the Ace of Pentacles energy here. Okay, let me get something with this Ace of Pentacles. Because this is something new. It's a new opportunity, a new resource. Also, Cancer energy. We have the Nine of Wands energy here. Oh, no, nah, but this is too many. We got the Nine of Wands energy here. Okay, this is somebody that is very strong. Someone that's not backing down. Someone that's going to take on an opportunity. It's like a person is watching this whole thing unfold because the Page of Sword was first. And then we have the Two of Cups. Something about like your relationship is being protected or this opportunity, this union is being protected we have the seven of pentacles here it could even be some type of investment or hmm something you're not giving up on let me get something here with this at the bottom is the lovers yeah some type of union some type of like attraction there it doesn't necessarily have to be sexual but it's a it's a choice here. It's like a good choice, though. It's like a really good choice. We got the hangman energy here. So this is someone that's perhaps seeing you in a different light because you're getting like different partnerships or you're getting different. I don't know if it's contracts, you're getting different opportunities or you're something changed for you. And there's a person watching it. And they're like, damn, like I missed, uh, for real, I'm getting that energy. I've been getting that energy today, man. It's like deep, deep. And then we have the Eight of Pentacles right on top of the Eight of Pentacles. Now, what's the chances of that? The Eight of Pentacles on top of the Eight of Pentacles, this person, like they see you. They see that you're skilled. They see you're talented. They're watching. They're watching. The Page of Sword is out here right now. They're watching. And it was the first card. They're watching. Let me get something here with this chariot. But I feel like this is somebody from the past. Yeah, we have the five of swords energy here. It's like they still have a problem. They just, why do they have a problem? It's not like they can say you're a bad person or you do bad work or you're not skilled. They can't say that. But it's only because you're moving forward. Like you have some type of drive. You have some type of discipline. Like, that's what I'm seeing here. This Five of Swords, look at it. It's facing the Eight of Pentacles. They're looking at it. I'm just reading what I'm seeing here. And it's like, how are you going to have a problem with somebody? They're doing a good job. They minding their business. They concentrating on what they're doing. Well, how, how, does that, how does that make sense? How does that compute? Like, please. I'm just trying to understand, too. Even though they see the truth, they still want to talk shit. Let me get something here with the Ace of Pentacles. And it's like, that's another thing. It's like, 
your shit is moving forward. Your life is moving forward. Your whatever you're doing, your skill, your profession, whatever it is you do, that's moving forward. Like it's clearly moving forward. So what's the problem? Let me get something here. So were they just jealous? Yeah, we got the three of swords. They just jealous because you're getting this opportunity. You're getting offers. That's why they're jealous. Let me get something here. It all started with that page of sword. Now we got five of sword, three of sword. They just hurt. Just say you're hurt. Just admit it to yourself and maybe it would take some of the burden off of you. Like it just hurts your feeling. Don't deny it because when you deny it, that's when you start getting deep into your shadow when you start doing things that you wouldn't normally do just say that your feelings is hurt man i'm trying to help somebody today just say your feelings is hurt and you need to work on that that's all you got to do shit count to 10 if somebody else's happiness messes with your mind stop watching them stop thinking about them count to 10 when you do think about them breathe you know just like come on that's crazy as hell. We have the Queen of Cups energy here. Let me get something with the Queen of Cups. She's only, what, the second court card to come out. Could be a water sign I'm talking about. Also, Pisces energy. Oh, we got Scorpio. Yeah, water signs. So we got Scorpio here also. Let me get something here. Could be that you ended that relationship and now we got Pisces we got all water signs here Pisces here well Pisces twice yeah we got cancer here too yeah we got all water signs and the Queen of Cups that's water so what is this here it's like something it's like they're being cut off or something is fading away for them or something is decreasing declining Okay, let me get something here. Yeah, and then the Five of Wands is at the bottom. I mean, not Five of Wands. The King of Wands was at the bottom. Let me get something here with this hangman. We have the Three of Pentacles here. Something about maybe the team, teamwork, working together, like getting things done. It's something here they're seeing differently. Like, it could be someone that tried to say you were not skilled, but then you leave... And you're skilled as fuck. And they knew that before. That's what's weird about it. They knew. See confirmation. You see how my phone keep going off? They knew. They were jealous. And they couldn't look themselves in the mirror and just admit it and move on. Let me get something here with this Eight of Pentacles. We have the Seven of Pentacles energy here. The Seven of Pentacles out here twice. So the Eight of Pentacles is out here twice and the Seven of Pentacles is out here twice. Hmm. It's, it's It makes me feel like something is still growing. Something is still, like, let's say incomplete, but not in a bad way. Like, let's say you have, like, a clothing line or something like that, like, you're making money, but it's not exactly where you want it to be or something like that. It could be something like that. It could be, but it's just not complete yet. And that's okay. That's even better that you haven't reached the peak of something. Let me get something with this five of sword. And we got the five of pentacles. See, they want something to decrease. That's what they want. They want something to be incomplete. They want someone to feel like they wasted their time. But come on now. Why would they be watching? Why would they be all in your energy, all in your business? They looking at everything except what they need to be looking at, which is like working on themselves, turning within. That's what they just don't see. And that's why I be saying that shit. Just go look in the mirror real quick and say, you know what? I'm really jealous of this person and I need to work on myself because I don't want to be jealous of this person. Just go fucking say that. Okay, I'm going to be nice. Just go say that, please. Okay, it's okay. There are emotions. But when that shit starts turning into anger and actions and all that shit, that's when we have a problem. If you could just nip that shit in the butt, like, everything would just be different. Golly. 
And we have the hermit card. That's what I'm saying, man. This shit is giving me a headache. It's like you just need to turn within. Please, somebody turn within. Please, leave this person alone. You didn't like them, leave them alone. Whatever this is, man. Clearly, someone knows what they're doing because they're moving forward. We have the Ace of Wands energy here. Yeah, in their power, taking action, knowing their purpose. Someone is very strong. This Queen of Cups, they might be a Queen of Cups, but they are not to be played with. Not the way that these uh, Wands is set up. Because we don't have any wands in this reading other than these two. The one that's above the Queen of Wands head and the one that's below it. And the one that's above it is the Nine of Wands. And the one that's below it is the Ace of Wands. And that's ten wands right there. Like, she's not playing. She may come off, like, all ethereal and beautiful and shit. But, like, it's really not a game. She's on a mission. It's not a game. It's really not a game. And it looks like the the relationship has been terminated and that's what they're recognizing like why would you stay somewhere you're not appreciated why would you want to that's what i'm saying like this person i don't know why they're watching you now i don't know why they're watching you now we have the seven of wands energy yeah they need to back up you see what i'm saying they want to attack and shit like that they need to go on and back up. The shit is over. The cycle is closed. You get what I'm saying? It is what it is. It's finished. Let me get something here with this moon card. It's finished. Let it go. The emperor here. Hmm. Now, it could also be something about you being the authority figure or in control over something or perhaps going over their head i've been getting that a lot too what is this at the bottom yeah we got the devil card it's like wow you're not even going to be in their domain yeah that's some crazy shit right there this person gonna stay down and they're going to look up to you because you are the emperor here this may be something that was hidden okay or it was an energy of like because the seven of pentacles is out here twice it's like this is invested time this is someone that has invested their energy their time their resources into something and they're getting it because it's the eight of pentacles something has increased but it's like you're going to receive more you're going to go further you're going to go deeper and maybe their deepest fear is that you're going to be over their head and that's the energy that I've been getting lately. It's someone that they're like seeing it like, oh shit. Like, look, let me get something else here. Like, you're going to be all right. This person probably played on your time. They probably did. They played on your time. There was supposed to be something built here. Queen of Cups is coming out. She says, I I'm coming to talk. <laughs> she said, I got something to say. What the Queen of One, I mean the Queen of Cups is talking about. Let me get something with this Seven of Pentacles. Like you wasting my time. And then we got the Page of Cups energy. Now what is that? Is that a child here? I don't know. It could be a child. It could be an apology. It could be somebody that's just immature. Let me get something here. Let me see what direction this is going because the Queen of Cups is not even facing the Page of Cups. We have the four of wands energy. It could, it seems like an apology. What? Oh my God. Let me get some. I got to get the rest of this line out here. We have the nine of cups here. Yeah, it looks like somebody's trying to, I don't know. They're trying to connect, but it seems like an innocent energy. I'm seeing an innocent. And if it's not this person trying to come into your energy, um, this is the energy of believing in a vision, believing in a dream, believing in your, your imagination, perhaps, maybe, and achieving something. 
like believing in your dreams, believing you're going to make it, believe you're skilled enough to do something and move forward and do it. That's what they're watching. Let me get something here. We have the death card out here twice. Scorpio energy, the end of the cycle, like it just can't go back. It's really over. Like this is a this is a huge transformation for someone. Scorpio or any water sign because the water signs are out here, like all of them. We got the seven of cups here. It's like, don't be fooled by something here. Don't be fooled. This person has no business coming back in your energy. They have no business coming back in your energy. None at all. None at all. Yeah, look, three of cups. I knew they was going to try. Nah, you need to look at that shit real sideways. If they try to come back in your energy, this could have been, I don't know if they fired you. It's something here. They're in your energy and you're doing your thing. You're moving forward. And I think there's a past part to this. I don't think it started with somebody just looking at your shit. I think it started way before that. What is this at the bottom? Yeah, the hermit card. And they got the little lantern here. It's like they're looking for something. They're trying to discover something. That's what I'm saying. They need to turn within with that. Why are they looking at you? They need to look at them. Also, Virgo energy, Capricorn. It says symphony. Like something working together. It says harmony, co-create, team. Maybe this person wants you back. They want you on their team. You don't need them, though. You don't need their fuck. Look, I'm going to be 100%. You don't need no friendship. You don't need no damn position. You don't need nothing from this person. Okay? People don't know how to treat people. That's a problem. They need to learn their lesson. It says slingshot. Okay, tension. You don't need... It's like, I can't imagine going back to some job that tried to shit on me. I cannot imagine it because there's going to be tension there. It might not be tension at every moment because, you know, people like to see the positive in things. But when it really starts to get going, yeah, there's going to be issues because this person is not going to change. Okay? Do not return to this person. You did not get blessed or you're not getting blessed so that you can return to that same person and try the same shit again. It says white rabbit. Okay? Spiritual awakening, heeding the call, inner knowing, going down the rabbit hole, waking from the dream. You're not there anymore. You wherever they're wanting you to be, you're not there anymore. It says Phoenix, transformation, eternal soul, renew, resurrection. Okay, rising from the ashes here. The end is just the beginning. Also saw ascension. Let me get something here. That's why they want to come in your energy. That's why they're watching you. But you can't go back in your energy. You can't go back in their energy because that's like going back into hell. That's like going back into a lower domain. You cannot do that. If you do that, that's on you. But just know that you know what you're going to get because that's a low vibe and energy. It can't possibly. Okay, how can I say this? There is no paradise in hell. There's no paradise in hell. Okay? So don't let the devil convince you that everything is just going to be good. Everything going to be okay. Everything is going to, you know, it's going to be better. There is no paradise in hell. Love. There is no love in hell. It's just not where it's at. I commit to the practice of seeing the good in all things. Then, yeah, you definitely need to be away from people like that. You need to see the real shit. It says service. Yeah. I feel good when I can help others. That is another thing that this person knows probably. They'll take advantage of that. Just don't return to this shit. There's no paradise in hell. Blame. Yeah. It's going to get uncomfortable. I'm telling you. I'm. And it says humor. I feel like somebody would try to hide something behind their humor. They try to hide shit behind their humor. Maybe this was a problem in the past. But people be saying shit under their breath. They be saying shit behind other things. That's what I'm saying. Leave that whole shit alone. That's not okay. It's not okay. People be thinking it's funny. It's okay. It's not okay. That's not how you treat people. That's not respectful. Like, that's not higher class. That's not... I'm just saying, like... That shit is crazy to me. Let me get something here with this. It says gratitude... Yeah, somebody need to be thankful. Maybe somebody need to light a candle, number 35. I don't know, a pink candle. Maybe it's something to do with the ancestors. I don't know. 
You don't even need to focus on this person. It says knowledge. Maybe you're giving gratitude for the knowledge, okay? Or for, you know, understanding who you was dealing with and who you cannot return to. Gratitude for what you've been given. It says protection. You have to know. Number 35, number 34, and then number one. At the bottom, it says grounded like anchored in something emotionally knowing for 100% sure you got to keep yourself protected I'm even getting somebody maybe you're learning something maybe there's a flame that's being lit within you a light that's being lit within you and you're learning more you're about to learn more is something here about protection or protecting yourself because I get the feeling this person has done this before it's like a trap it's always a trap there's no paradise in hell like they really try to make it seem like that and then here we go the fuck again let me get an angel message here. It says expect miracles. And it says vulnerability and freedom. Freedom from this person. Okay, expect miracles. Shit will never be the same. It's not going to be bad. It's going to be a whole bunch better for getting away from this person and going doing what you're supposed to do. Okay, your skill, your talent, it's real. They know it watch i'm gonna leave it right here if you like the way that i read please like share and subscribe thank you so much for your like shares and subscribes i truly appreciate it because it is how we get the messages out in order to elevate the collective i love you guys and i'll be back with another reading later bye